Hello there guys, Dave Nader right here, and today i got another movie review for you. Now, today's a little bit different. I'm reviewing Smosh, the movie, released in 2015, and, you know, I'm pretty sure you guys, if you're watching this video, it is a YouTube video, and if you watch YouTube videos, you've probably heard of Smosh, and you've probably seen at least some of their videos, because they're one of the most popular YouTube channels on the internet, and, um... Now, I, I have a mi Smosh is a mixed bag for me. I love some of their videos, like some, mainly some of their early videos, but their videos recently, painful. Like, it's really bad. It's like the worst Adam Sandler type juvenile humor. It's just really not well written. But on July 24th, their movie was released, and this is a comment I left on one of their videos, their most recent video up to that point, uh, released on July 24th. Now, this is a comment I left. Wow, I have not watched a Smosh video in over a year, that was true, and I have not looked up anything on the internet related to them either. And the very day that I all of a sudden decided I feel like watching a Smosh video again, which was July 24th, it turns out that their first feature film is being released today. Talk about timing. That I left that comment, I seriously, like, uh, I hadn't looked up anything about them since early 2014, just because I got really sick of them, I didn't like their humor anymore. And so I just, I completely stayed away from it. I had no idea they were making a movie. And the very, it turns out, July 24th, just happened to be the day to where I was like, yeah, I feel like watching one of their videos again. I haven't seen them in a while. I wanted to check it out. Turns out their movie was being released that day. That's pretty, that's actually pretty, that's kind of cool, isn't it? Uh, at least it is to me. But anyway, let's get to the movie. Uh, plot? Plot doesn't really matter. Okay, fine. Um, Ian and Anthony, they have to a video gets posted on the internet that's embarrassing for Anthony, and so Ian and Anthony, they go to uh, YouTube headquarters, and then they go into a portal that puts them inside YouTube, and they have to jump from video to video until they find that video and alter the events in that video to change it, and so it's not that video on the internet, so it's not embarrassing uh, Anthony. And so that's actually a pretty good concept. Um, and, you know, I, I like the idea for that. Problem is, this movie sucks. This movie is... Holy crap, this movie sucked. I, I really wanted to like this movie. Okay, for the first 30 minutes, I was trying so hard to just completely turn my brain off. Because I just, I wanted to like it. Because for a while there, I did really enjoy Smosh. At times, their humor was really stupid. But generally, it was really stupid. But in a good way, actually funny. Like, a good Adam Sandler comedy. Like Billy Madison or Happy Gilmore. Those movies are hilarious. Jack and Jill is not hilarious, and this movie is Jack and Jill humor. Oh, gosh, it makes me sad. It really does. Why do they have to suck? They're just... It doesn't seem like they're trying anymore. And they have much better production quality than they used to. You know, they actually have camera crews in there uh, filming their YouTube videos. And they got the director of Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure to actually direct this movie. Which, technically, is kind of cool. Although, really, that's not impressed to me. When I first heard that, I was like, wow, they got the director of Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure to be in this? That's interesting. You know, they actually got a professional director. And now it's Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. A lot of people like that movie. But then all of a sudden I remember, like, oh, wow, that's right. A lot of people like that movie, but I freaking hate Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. Well, okay, I didn't hate it, but I, w I didn't like it that much hardly at all. I just didn't think it was that funny, honestly. It's just, it's stupid humor, but not good stupid. And, and that scene to where they... All of a sudden, travel in time, and they find that room to where it's like the Time Lords or whatever they're called. And then they like play air guitar for three minutes, and it's supposed to mean something. And it doesn't. It's the most time wasting scene ever. I, I don't think that guy's a good director. I, I haven't seen anything from him that I liked. And this is no exception. Because this movie's a flying piece of turd. This would, that didn't mean anything. That was stupid. But yeah, just Ian and Anthony. Oh my gosh. They're so annoying in this movie. Like, Anthony was always my least favorite of the two. Or, well, less favorite of the two. I guess it's proper grammar. Uh, always in Smosh. I mean, don't get me wrong. He had plenty of funny moments. But overall, Ian, I always thought was more funny. And Anthony, just... The guy, he always overacts too much, even for a goofy humor type video. Like, Smosh videos are supposed to be. Even in their best videos. In their worst videos? Holy crap, he's so annoying. And this is just like... One of their worst videos. Problem is, it's an hour and a half long, and I have to endure that. And they're, they're good ideas, like them jumping from YouTube video to YouTube video. But you know what would have been a lot better? 
if they would have jumped back into some of their own YouTube videos, like some of their older YouTube videos. That would have been a lot cooler than just jumping into random fake YouTube videos that aren't funny and like, oh, Markiplier shows up and some other YouTuber shows up that I don't watch her videos for, but I know she's popular. And it's just like, haha, they're here, it's funny. No, it's not funny. This movie isn't funny at all. There's nothing to this movie. It's stupid. It's a horrible movie. And I hate to say it, but I gotta give this movie an F. Now, this is the first straight-up negative review that I've ever posted on this channel. I'm sorry, guys, all negative today, but I couldn't help it. I hated this movie. Anyway, guys, if you like this review, please rate and comment and subscribe. And if you want to, you can also share. Goodbye.